Okay, so we're going to do a little testing of this Behringer right here. This is a UMC 202 HD, and we're going to do a little testing with the Roll Pipe mic right here. And again, this is just a really nice interface that is a little bit bigger than the little brother. Here's the little brother right here. It is made out of plastic. This is UM2, and this is awesome. If you're a solo creator on a budget, this is definitely not a bad choice at all. I did record a lot of videos with this. But again, if you want to kind of step it up, this one right here is really nice as well. This one gives you the ability to have two inputs. You can record a podcast with two people, which is really fantastic. It's made out of metal, which is a lot better than the little one. And again, it's just a pretty simple setup. If you see this cable right here is connected to my computer. Then when I go into my system, I pick this as your audio source. And really, it's a pretty simple setup. You have here your connection right here, your XLR. Again, you could bring somebody else and have a second person. And again, you have different gains for each channel. So that's good. You have a pad. You have a way to pick instrument or voice. So again, if you have an instrument, obviously, you press down uh, voice a little bit higher. You have a way to monitor your audio. Only one person, but obviously... Uh, you could buy a splitter or something like that. You do have a signal indicator, says it's right there, and then you have a clip indicator as well. You do have the ability to bring 48 power to this, and you see it right here, right? So, again, this is pretty good. This is really a really nice setup. It's made out of metal, really strong, something that is easy to use that you could put in your desk around here. It doesn't take a lot of space. And this is kind of like the audio you're going to get out of this, right? So I'm giving you a test. Now I'm going to give you a test after doing a little bit or post-production that I did to it, reduce some of the background noise and all that. So again, really, really cool. I like this setup a lot. I think it's really fantastic and it does offer a lot of different capability really for not so much money.